Hi Tracy. Um, to get the um, results that you want, I'm going to just show you a method here. Um, I'm going to pop into grades really quick and take a look at the categories and items. And now we can see that uh, you know course total is 1529 points. Um, what we'll want to do so is click on the items that are pretests. So for example, this midterm pretest. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to go ahead and just hit the edit tab here. I'm going to scroll down and switch this max grade to zero and hit save changes. Um, I'm going to go back into the grades again um, and, and zero out another one. So uh, let's just do the chapter seven pretest um, and hit edit. Um, and just switch the max grade here again to zero points. Um, now you can go through the um, through the grading interface that way, or you can just click on quizzes here, and it'll pop each of these up, um, which might be a little faster. It's going in this way, and switching these all to zero points for your pretests. So I'm gonna just hop up here real quick and, and click on grades and take a look now and we should see about a 120 point decline in uh, the grade for this uh, item. So if you just set all of these to zero um, what you'll end up with um, is in the max grade is you're gonna see um, your overall total here decline uh, which is I think the behavior that you're looking for. Um, the other thing that you'll want to do um, is hit add a grade item and then here you could have uh, just call this a bonus points for uh, midterm pretests um, and then <clears throat> just change the max grade on this to 50 because um, based on your on your email looks like those are worth 50 points just hit save changes and now this is going to show up <clears throat> at the bottom to make the grading easier on it though uh, I'm, I'm going to recommend that what you do is put this at the top um, and pop it up here um, and you can check this to be extra credit and save the changes um, that'll keep it from being added into the uh, into the total now <clears throat> The other nice thing with the reason I moved it to the top is that when you're in the grader report, it's going to put it right here first. So when you turn the editing on to grade this uh, and assign point values, you can just go through the list and it'll be right next to the student name. It just makes it a faster, easier way to grade it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and leave those items in uh, your ALH 100 W04 course because um, I'm assuming that's something you're already going to want to do. Um, but I'll leave it in there for you, and if you need, it, need them taken back out or switched back, just shoot me back an email.